welcome back to the channel today i find myself in one of india's most luxurious resorts nestled in 60 acres of lush rainforest welcome to kurg wilderness resort and in this video i'm going to be sharing my experiences and impressions after staying 3 days in this beautiful place and if you guys are new to the channel main ek full time doctor hu and apne clinic ke baad free time mein khud se travel videos banata and i have been making such videos for a couple of years now and this has taken me to some insane resorts and villas in india and on this channel we try and explore some amazing places in india and abroad we also focus on the importance of work life balance and investing in experiences through this journey called as life so if you vibe with all that consider subscribing anyways apne headphones laga lo and let's get this video started guys good morning super excited to tell you that today i am in this beautiful place called as kurg wilderness resort this is truly one of india's most luxurious resort and one of the best places i have ever stayed in and in this video i'm going to be taking you along with me as i stay here for three whole days i'm going to be giving you a super detailed virtual tour of this place if you guys don't know we do similar videos on the channel previously i've made many videos about many luxurious places in india and today i'm fortunate enough to be invited to stay here for three whole days i'm going to be sharing my entire experience from check in to check out everything so if you guys are planning a trip or just want to know about this beautiful place let's get this video started so first of all let's talk a little bit about the logistics of where this place is kurg wilderness resort as the name suggest is in the area called as kurg it is in karnataka near a town called as madikeri okay madikeri basically the center of the kurg region to reach here you can either take two options you can fly into mangalore or kannur airport kannur airport is closer it is like 90 km mangalore airport is little far away but because of the flight timings i landed at mangalore they picked us up in this comfortable car all organized by the resort and uh, after a very scenic beautiful drive we came here beach mein we stopped for coffee at this local cafe it was so nice surrounded by greenery we reached at around 7 7:30 kafi dark ho gaya tha but uh, with a warm welcome checked in last night after checking in they took us to our room and wo log ne hum log ko pura property ka ek tour diya where everything is in this electric buggy it was so cute they showed us around this entire property it's massive okay and everything yahan pe electric hai ye log ke bikes ye log ke buggies and everything is super electric so this resort is located basically in 60 acres of rainforest okay and usme se kuch 20 acres ye log coffee farming ke liye use karte hain in fact the coffee they provide here is all grown and processed here and it was amazing i just had some coffee it was beautiful and rest of it is all complete rainforest okay and that's why you can always hear birds constantly whenever i'm standing here birds ka awaaz to always it's there it's beautiful we are staying in this room category called as the groove view suite the moment you enter you can just see everything ka fit finish quality is super super refined and from what i've been told everything is imported from indonesia okay each and everything the furniture the beds the the tiles se leke a lot of things have been imported from indonesia and you can just see it this is this does not belong here aisa craftsmanship aapko india mein nahi milta hai see the lounger chairs in the living room uh, the fireplace you know the big sofa the other sitting chair the living room is beautiful and there is a non functional fireplace but it gets very cold here okay this place is of course kurg is known as the scotland of the east and the purpose of this place was to replicate a very scotland like experience right this balcony see the architecture see the roof and everything is very scotland like and of course wahan pe fireplace hai and uh, if you, if it gets very cold you of course have a electric heater as well normally throughout the year average temperature yahan pe 20 24 degrees rehta even in summer okay highest it goes up to 26 degrees so that's why there are no air conditioners in this room in any room because they wanted to keep it eco friendly at the same time yahan pe cooling bhi acha hi hai and right now also we woke up to 18 degrees in june that's insane so basically the entire room is one long stretch okay it starts from the living then the bedroom you see the bed nice comfortable nice soft pillows you have hard pillows ka option as well then there is a nice little ottoman you have switches right next to the bed phone and everything everything ka fit and finish is super premium then coming from the bedroom 
टू लाइक द स्टडी स्लैश पैंट्री एरिया पैंट्री एरिया में कॉफ़ी मेकर इफ दे हैव अ नाइस एल फ्रेंच प्रेस यू मेड आर मॉर्निंग कॉफ़ी राइट नाउ आई एम अ बिग कॉफ़ी लवर यू विल लव द कॉफ़ी हेयर नेक्स्ट टू द कॉफ़ी दे हैव द पैंट्री बेजिक आपका फ्रिज एंड एवरी थिंग विथ ऑल योर सप्लाईज मिनी बार एंड एवरी थिंग एंड बिहाइंड ऑफकोर्स यू हैव अ सेफ एंड कबर्ड एंड ऑफकोर्स एक स्टडी टेबल है फॉर यू टू वर्क एंड जस्ट चिल दे हैव मस्कीटो नेट्स एवरी वेयर बिकॉज ऑफकोर्स दिस इज अ जंगल मैनी इंसेक्ट्स बट देर आर मस्कीटो नेट्स एवरी वेयर एंड ऑल द विंडोज आर इन अ वे कि ऑफकोर्स खुला रखो मस्कीटो नेट्स है वहाँ पर तो इट्स ऑलवेज एयर सर्कुलेशन इज ऑलवेज देयर एंड कमिंग टू माई फेवरेट पार्ट ऑफ द रूम यू के दिस बैल्कनी राइट द बैल्कनी ओपन्स अप टू द फॉरेस्ट हेयर एंड यू कैन सी बर्ड्स यू कैन सी बटरफ्लाईज just sit here have a morning co- cup of coffee that's what we did morning we just chilled here enjoyed the morning had our coffee and uh, i'm going to spending a lot of time here just look at this bahut bahut thandi hawa chalti hai so so peaceful even if i am talking right now in the background you'll be able to hear so many birds so this is my favorite part of the entire place the balcony and so thoughtfully if you see all this uh, you can open the entire uh, room okay this entire ये जो दरवाजे हैं यू कैन ओपन दैम सो स्मॉल थिंग्स लाइक दिस दे रियली मेक अ लॉट ऑफ डिफरेंस कमिंग टू द बाथरूम ओके नाउ बाथरूम इज प्रियाज फेवरेट पार्ट ऑफ द एंटायर रूम शी गेट्स टू एक्साइड विद बाथरूम्स इन एवरी थिंग इनफैक्ट इज इवन बिगर देन द बेड एंड द स्टडी एरिया ओके सी द बाथरूम ओके सेंटर में देर इज अ बिग ऑटोमेन लेदर ऑटोमेन फॉर यू टू सेट राइट फुल लेंथ मिलर ऑफकोर्स दिस क्यूट लिटल बाट अप ओके यू कैन सेट देर यू कैन आज देम टू डेकोरेट द एंटायर बाथरूम फॉर यू इफ यू हैव सम स्पेशल ओकेजन दे विल डेकोरेट द एंटायर बाथरूम फॉर यू दे विल ड्रॉ यू अ बाथ एंड ऑफकोर्स अ बिग मिरर ओके टू बेजेंस विथ ऑल योर सप्लाईज ऑल योर एम्यूनिटीज एंड द हाईलाइट ऑफ द बाथरूम इज अ हीटेड फ्लोरिंग ओके दैट्स इन सेम राइट जो पानी जो गर्म होता है द हीटिंग प्रोसेस जो है दैट फ्लोर्स बीनीथ द बाथरूम ओके दैट्स वाई द एंटायर फ्लोर इज हीटेड द सेटिस्फैक्शन ऑफ स्टैंडिंग ऑन अ हीटेड फ्लोर इज समथिंग एल्स ओनली वेन यू इन द बाथरूम एंड द फ्लोर इज सो हीटेड मैं तो बैठ गया नीचे थोड़े टाइम के लिए इट वॉज सो नाइस सो या दैट वॉज अ क्विक रूम टूर एंड आई एम गुड बी शोइंग यू अदर रूम्स एज वेल ऑफ जो यहाँ पर डिफरेंट ऑप्शन जो है दे हैव दे विल बी शोइंग मी दी अदर रूम्स एज वेल फॉर मी टू शो यू गाइज एंड एज इन वेन यू स्टार्ट एक्सप्लोरिंग द रिसॉर्ट वो दिखाते जाऊँगा मैं आपको वन बाई वन सो रहा नाइट नाउ इट्स नाइन फोर्टी फाइव एम यू लॉट्स ऑफ थिंग्स प्लान फॉर दिस डे वी गोइंग फॉर अ नेचर वॉक देन आई एम गुड बी शोइंग यू दिस एंटायर रिसॉर्ट द पूल एरिया द स्पा एरिया द जिम uh the general chill out space and the main entrance everything i'm going to be showing you giving you a complete tour so yeah continue watching and let's start exploring the resort chalo so after enjoying a quiet morning in our room first we went for breakfast And since we already heard, let's talk about the food options and different restaurants that are available at the resort. The main restaurant where breakfast and dinner buffet is served is called as the Habba. It is close to the reception area and overlooking the Kurg Hills. This place is huge and can seat guests from more than 100 rooms in the resort. The buffet spread was massive and the food was truly delicious. From continental to north and south Indian delicacies, the buffet spread was pretty comprehensive. All the times we had food here we were always left wanting for more and with a smile on our face you can also come here for lunch for their a la carte menu as well and that is what we did later this afternoon having a meal with the sound of rain and birds overlooking these lush hills was so relaxing apart from this there is a second restaurant called as vemmanad which specializes in local flavors and seafood vegetarian options are also available you should plan to have at least one of your meals at this unique restaurant And to blow off some steam, there is a cool bar on the property called as Tipsy, with an impressive collection of wines and spirits. You must try their house specialities. The Tipsy bar has a very chill ambience and it has its own menu for finger food and bar snacks. Anyways, after breakfast, we started exploring the resort and wanted to check out the activities and the amenities the resort had to offer. First, we went for a nature walk, which is an activity that is organized by the resort. A guide will take you around to nearby walking trails and explain about the different flora and fauna in the region. It was an awesome experience just to walk around the dense forest, learn about the plants and different fruits, insects and animals that are found in this region. 
there are many other activities to keep you busy at the resort. In the morning, like you saw, we went for a nature walk. Later that evening, there was also a fun activity called as the coffee experience. Here, you will learn everything you need to know about coffee, from growing to manufacturing and to different ways of enjoying it. Like me, if you guys enjoy coffee, you will definitely love this activity. Along with this, there is a dedicated adventure area, which has some cool stuff like rock climbing and zip lining, which can be enjoyed throughout the day by all. Apart from this, there are activities like bird watching and a sunset walk which was scheduled for tomorrow and we'll get to it very soon. After lunch, we started exploring the rest of the resort. Specifically, we wanted to check out the pool, the indoor games area, the different room categories and quiet corners around the property. I'm going to let the video do all the talking as all these places are too pretty to be described. Hey guys, good morning. Day two here at Cool Wilderness Resort. सुबह के कुछ छः बजे उठे हम लोग. For this activity, call it bird watching. यहाँ पे सात बजे bird watching होता है. Because like I already told you, ये जो है वो पूरा एक rain forest है. कभी-कभी तो इतने सारे bird के आवाज आते हैं कि मेरा drone का noise भी muffled हो जाता है. It's it's completely surrounded by birds. इसलिए bird watching is a very fun activity to do here. Look at the vibe in the morning. Like it's completely fog, पूरा fog है सामने वाला तो वहाँ पर दिख भी नहीं रहा है एंड यहाँ से प्रॉपर्टी के थ्रू ही फॉग फ्लो हो रहा है दैट्स दैट्स मैड 
बस थोड़ी यहाँ की मॉर्निंग वाइफ दिखाता हूँ एंड देन वी गो फॉर द बर्ड वॉक प्रिया तो उठी है अब तक कि नहीं उठी है नहीं आज उठ गई उठ गई है क्लाउड देख के उठ गई हूँ क्लाउड देख के उठ गई प्रिया इज नॉट अ मॉर्निंग पर्सन आई एम अ बिग मॉर्निंग पर्सन तो थोड़ा चैलेंजिंग फॉर प्रिया बट आई थिंक क्लाउड हैज मेड अर हैवी मॉर्निंग So why the hornbills are very famous because uh, they have a breeding time in the month of start in the April, May and uh, uh, February if it starts means February, March and April. So like around sixty days is a duration time. So the male will find one of the best nest close to the tree where they can seal it from the outside. So without any disruption. गाइस, सो वो बर्ड वॉक के बाद उन्होंने अच्छा ब्रेकफास्ट किया जस्ट रोम अराउंड द रिसोर्ट पूल गए पूल के अच्छे शॉर्ट्स लिए एंड ऑफ अनफॉर्चुनेटली बहुत ही बारिश हो रही थी तो इट वाज सो कोल्ड टू गेट इन बट द पूल लुक्स सो गुड इट्स लाइक ऑन अ समर और अ विंटर डे यू कैन कम अच्छे से वहाँ पर स्विमिंग कर सकते हो इट्स सच अ नाइस चिल वाइव इन द पूल आई जस्ट होप कि थोड़ी बारिश और कम हो तो आई कैन गो एंड टेक अ डिप इन द पूल एज वेल एनी वेज बस उसके बाद वी जस्ट चिल्ड इन द रूम ऑर्डर्ड इन ऑर्डर्ड फूड इन बहुत अच्छे से खाया जस्ट हैड सम ड्रिंक्स एट आ बैल्कनी रूम एन्जॉय किया बेसिकली एंड नाउ फॉर सनसेट वॉट दे डू इज इट द रिसॉर्ट दे हैव दिस नाइस एरिया बिल्ड ओके इज कॉल द सनसेट पॉइंट रिसॉर्ट के प्रिमाइस के अंदर ही है इट कॉल इज सनसेट पॉइंट बिकॉज ऑफ कॉर्स इज फेसिंग वेस्ट एंड इट्स सो सो बिंडी राइट नाउ मैं इसके ड्रोन शॉट्स नहीं ले सकता इट्स सो विंडी बिकॉज आई नो द ड्रोन विल फ्लाई अवे इन फैक्ट वेन आई वॉज जस्ट शूटिंग टेकिंग सम बी रोल फॉर दिस शॉट द कैमरा फेल आई जस्ट पुट द क्लिप यूर द ट्राईपॉड फेल ओके पूरा ट्राईपॉड में पूरा कैमरा है पूरा गिर गया नीचे इट्स सो सो विंडी बट इट्स सो नाइस नॉट फॉर शूटिंग एस्पेक्ट्स बट एस्पेक्ट द वाइफ के लिए the clouds the greenery it's so so beautiful i don't know if you guys can hear this also or not wind muffler lagaya hai but uh, i don't know if you guys can hear this anyways uh, if you guys are coming here this is a must do activity just look at all this charo taraf 360 degree view of the entire pur ka jo rain forest hai so so beautiful especially monsoon mein the vibe is amazing so i'm going to try and do justice to this place with this camera सो या ये थोड़ा वाइब एंजॉय करो एंड उसके बाद जाएंगे नाइस रिलैक्सिंग मसाज के लिए चलो that we come to the end of three beautiful days here in this beautiful property i think 3 to 4 days are perfect for uh, this place <laughs> i would have liked to stay more but of course uh, at sunday here we are flying back home right now it's 7:40 
वी आर वी आर फ्लाइंग आउट फ्रॉम मैंगलोर कॉस्ट ऑफ कॉस्ट इज डिल डिफरेंट डिपेंडिंग ऑन योर रूम जो मैंने तीन रूम कैटेगरी बताया आपको उसके कॉस्ट एज ऑफ नाउ आई पुट इट ह्योर बिकॉज कॉस्ट कीप चेंजिंग राइट बिकॉज ऑफ द डिमांड एंड द सीजन एंड एवरीथिंग सो एज ऑफ नाउ जो कॉस्ट है आई जस्ट पुट इट डाउन ह्योर ये स्लाइटली ऑन द प्राइज ये साइड कम्पेयर टू अदर होटल्स बट फॉर स्पेशल ओकेजन हो बर्थ डेज एनिवर्सरीज या सेलिब्रेटिंग एनी थिंग आई जस्ट वॉन्ट अ ब्रेक फ्रॉम एवरी थिंग आई ऑलवेज से इन्वेस्ट इन एक्सपीरियंसिस या पहले आपका बेसिक इन्वेस्टमेंट भी करो बट देन ऑफकोर्स इन्वेस्ट इन एक्सपीरियंस ओके दिल स्टे विथ यू फॉर अ वेरी वेरी लॉन्ग टाइम एंड विल एड वैल्यू टू योर लाइफ एंड जस्ट एट द एंड ऑफ द डे गिव यू ग्रेट स्टोरीज टू टेल से गुड बाय टू दिस प्लेस इज़ वेरी डिफिकल्ट जाने का मन ही नहीं कर रहा है जो ऐसे लग रहा है छुट्टी खत्म हो गई वापस कल से स्कूल चालू है एंड या सो एंड इज इट फॉर नाउ Uh, if you guys like this video please subscribe to the channel share it with your friends and don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you guys have any doubts about this place kuch bhi rahe chota sa chota doubt rooms ke bare mein uh, activities ke bare mein or just any logistical doubt put it down in the comment section below i'll be more than happy to answer them for you that is it for now until the next time stay safe keep on traveling i'll see you guys very soon